Wide open is Diggs. He leaps for it in the end zone. Touchdown, Vikings. What's this? A little out, up. Get greedy with your eyes as a corner, and you're going to get run by. But what a spectacular catch. Here's defense. On the spot, it's third and four against Bridgewater. Who has time and open. It's Diggs, and he can fly. Stephon Diggs spins in toward the end zone. Touchdown. Man is here, and the option route puts him on the ground, and then he, this kid shows the explosiveness, the headiness for the game, the willpower to get in for a touchdown that we've seen the past couple of weeks. Bridgewater protected, completing. It's Diggs inside the 10. Stephon Diggs diving. Touchdown, Minnesota. Bears defense of late has been underneath crossing routes. They run a lot of combination coverages, and they aren't proficient enough in this defense. And they have a lot of free runners, and that's what's the Go empty backfield on a second down. Bridgewater's going to loft one towards the end zone. Touchdown, Stephon Diggs. This is what you're talking about with Teddy Bridgewater. Can he put this team on his back, make throws like that? He's showing he wants to be that guy. What a beautiful throw by Bridgewater. He was shaken up before the commercial. Walks off basically unassisted. Bradford on play action, going to the end zone. You've got it, Diggs. Who else? So is Diggs good, but he's savvy. He went inside, worked back outside, which for most corners means energetic. One and six, Chicago team tonight. Floyd with the rush didn't get there, and it's a touchdown to Stephon Diggs. Extra man on the rush pass is caught by Diggs for the touchdown. The press on the outside. Diggs lines up in the slot. He goes to the corner, and and Bradford puts it out there. Pat Shermer talked about the need for more explosive plays. They're getting them. Here's a very explosive play. It's a touchdown to Stephon Diggs. Play action pass, and Diggs pulls Devontae Harris big time, who is peaking. With seven TD catches last year, 83 catches for the year. They throw to Diggs. Is it a catch, and is it in the end zone? Yes, and yes. And he punched the ball into the stands after a Minnesota touchdown. How about that catch? What a job by Diggs. This is a no-name receiving core, but man. They're inside the 20, and they have all those timeouts. Looking to the end zone for Diggs. He went up and got it. And a touchdown for Stephon Diggs. Between Hargraves, he's going to set him up outside. And you see where Case's aiming point is? The aiming point is the bay. This free play, although I don't see a flag down. Yes, it is. And this is going to go for a touchdown for Diggs. He just realized the defender almost got him. Well, he was held on the route. He was grabbed by the shoulder. That's a 12th man on the field when the ball was snapped and right watch, there. And watch the hold. See the grab right there? There yep. was sure jersey and cloth shown, and Diggs was strong enough to run through it. And again, when you're down in corners and you're attacking them deep, 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 the confidence. Rolling near side. Keaton firing. He's got a touchdown. Diggs. And that's going to Shotgun for Keaton. Keenum throws, end zone, it's caught by Diggs, touchdown Vikings. Well, a real bullet here on the post route by Diggs, squeezes it in between Fledgelum. Second and goal, off play action, Keenum to the back of the end zone, Diggs comes down with it, touchdown. Control in that first foot comes down that's the question Is there what they've done for this Vikings team second and nine Keenum fires and zone touchdown Diggs running game
game continues to help them because this comes off a of play action and going back to the towards the post. Williams here he has a shot I'm not sure really what he's thinking Joe he comes in he's got him dialed in and he just all he's got to do is make a play and even if he catches it you tackle him in bounds the game is over 61 brilliant yards for Stefan Diggs and Case Keenum has just taken <laughs> the Minnesota Vikings to the NFC Championship game Cousins has time going far sideline. End zone, it's Diggs! Touchdown! So watch Stephon Diggs, number 14 in purple against Akello Witherspoon, number 23. And this is how well this ball is thrown. It's right over the top of the helmet of Witherspoon. And what quarterbacks are taught is if you see the back of the head of the defensive back foot. Cousins firing end zone low throw and it's caught by Diggs. Touchdown. With that groin injury, Devon House, number 31, bottom of your screen, has played a lot for him. Here's Cousins. Going to let it fly. Going to let it go deep for Diggs. He's got it. Stephon Diggs. Touchdown. A bomb from Cousins to Diggs. But it's a matchup we talked about earlier in the ball game. Diggs and Devon House, he hasn't played much this season. And you just mentioned it again, Kevin King out, House in. Rudolph comes into the slot. Cousins looking, throwing, and that will be Stefan Diggs' touchdown. Goal. Full scoring plays reviewed in New York here. Down to 52 seconds. Fires and that will be caught by Diggs for the touchdown. So you've got 48 seconds. And drive for the Vikings here. Down by seven. Good protection again. Cousins fires wide open. Touchdown. Stephon Diggs. To get here and here, and you'll see Jamon Williams, who is now forced to play that slot cornerback slot, get turned around and tripped up, and is going to leave. Taking a conservative approach, they'll take their shots. Cousins, here's a shot for a touchdown. Stefan Diggs. The Vikings make it look easy on the opening drive of the day. Yeah, you got a right to strut after this play, but again. The, the Dolphins secondary, and again it's Mc Cousins fires for the end zone. Touchdown, Stephon Diggs. They made that look easy. Working against Marcus Cooper, who came in for the injured Darius Slay. What's Diggs doing over there? As you pointed out, Chris, going right after Marcus Cooper, who's in for Darius Slay, and it's just a simple speed out. Need that timeout. Cousins throws as he backpedals for the touchdown of Diggs. Going deep for Diggs. In the air. Diggs has him. It's a Viking touchdown. His first catch of the game. On this snap, and this is one heck of a throw. I thought it was going to get picked off by the safety coming across the field right there. Now there is a flag after the touch. Cousins first down going deep for Diggs. He makes the catch. Stephon Diggs. Touchdown. 62 yards. Upfield. And Rasul Douglas can see back there, but he just can't keep up. Stephon Diggs just essentially ran past him. 
Play action. Cousins digs. He's got it. Touchdown. 51 yards. Here's here's look at Diggs. And Rasul Douglas sitting down like it's zone coverage. So that is not man to man. That zone coverage the way he sat down and there's a breakdown. Play action. Cousins to the end zone. It is Diggs. His third touchdown today. One, two. Four and oh, one of two unbeaten teams along with New England. Third and two. Time for Cousins. Going deep. He's got Diggs. That's a touchdown. What a play. Diggs got it 54 yards. You'll see it here. He rolls to his left. He just watched the post. Watch the speed from Stefan Diggs. He's going to run right by Chris Harris. That was well done. Cousins going to loft it to the end zone. And Diggs. Touchdown Vikings. It's a really good job by Diggs. He wins at the line. And now Alexander is, is stacked. But what about the throw though? That's Five receivers going out here. Cousins going deep downfield and adjusting and making the grab is Stefan Diggs for the touchdown over Witherspoon for 41 yards. Ball by Kevin Stefanski right there. The only time you really get man coverage out of these cornerbacks of the 49ers is on third and short. Ramsey lined up against him. Josh Allen going that way, and he has Diggs. Buffalo gets the touchdown finally with Stephon Diggs. And got the look they wanted. Now first and goal, Allen keeps. And throws, it is caught for the touchdown. Stefan Diggs able somehow to keep his feet in bounds. So once you're working towards the sidelines, you know that, okay, well, he can't go any further. You can start trying to track the football. He never located. Second and one for the Bills. They handle the rush. Allen looking. End zone. Touchdown. Stefan Diggs with the grab. The Bills take the lead. Has been the best receiver in the NFL this season. And he ran against their number one cover guy, Patrick Peterson, and really just beat him with speed. Wasn't much guile, wasn't much of a, a move. All he did was beat him upfield and Allen beat them deep or a screen pass or something. Get Pittsburgh's pressure. Here's Allen throwing man down. Diggs got it inside the 10. Diggs to the goal line and in for the Buffalo touchdown. Inside, this is the second straight time that we've seen a Pittsburgh Steelers cornerback go down. And I tell you. Off the play action. Allen hit as he throws, able to complete it. Diggs and tail lights time. Diggs is looking back, touchdown, and he stumbles into the end zone. It's a 50 yard pass play from Josh Allen for the Buffalo Bills. He's going to run the post and then he's going to come over top with Stephon Diggs. Watch Josh Allen. He wants to throw the ball deep on the post. It's not there and he comes back well read by Josh Allen. And Diggs will do at the New England 18 on first down and 10. Continue to throw, continue to complete. It's Diggs, stays on his feet into the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. Here, this is a situation where the wide receiver would just get blown up. And here, you see the safety doesn't put a good hit on him. Obviously, New England made one there. Beasley hasn't been much of a factor yet tonight. Here's Allen. Being chased and throwing, oh, and it is oh, caught. <laughs> That's Stefan Diggs, the sliding grab. I'm going to throw the ball to Beasley, but I'm going to come back on the backside to Diggs. It was designed to go to him the entire time. They just want to buy time, and then how similar does that throw look to what Patrick Mahomes did two weeks ago? 
The ability to get your hips flipped. Fake it. Allen. Deep shot. Touchdown. On the line to Stefan Diggs. What a connection. Allen and Diggs have been doing it all season. That's right where he knew he had a one-on-one -on -one with the top receiver in the NFL this year, Stephon Diggs, and the backup corner, T.J. Carey. And Allen drops it right between the one and the four. Substitution-wise, quick throw here to the outside, and in for the touchdown goes Stephon Diggs. That's Sanders. Allen. Extending, extending. And able to find Stephon Diggs. Touchdown, Buffalo. There's Stephon Diggs and Xavier Howard on the top side. Now, all you young players out there, I want you to remember this. Never stop playing. Never stop. Even if you fall down like Stephon Diggs does, Xavier Howard, he packs it in. What does Diggs do? He gets back up. What's the result? Touchdown. Now another knee injury looks like in this game. Chris Jackson in there for Farley. The throw and the catch. Touchdown. Stephon Diggs. Good for 14 in the score. And he's now tied with his brother, Trayvon. They each have two touchdowns this season. Just watch this release by Stephon Diggs. No help in the middle of the field if you're sitting there in outside leverage. Play number nine on the drive. Allen over the middle to Diggs. Touchdown. And Diggs punts it into the stands. A 19-yard score. And the Bills go up 16 to them. You can go right back to him. Single coverage. Allen does exactly that to the end zone. Diggs has it. Touchdown. who was just otherworldly for this offense last year. Led the league in catches, rec yards, was incredible. Moss in the backfield. Allen to the air. Caught for the touchdown. Stephon Diggs. And he beat Rock Yassine. Six yard strike by quarterback Josh Allen. Is Moss third and goal at the nine. Here goes Allen on the move and throws, and it was caught on the play by Diggs. Nine-yard touchdown pass to Stephon Diggs. Fifth of the year. Beasley in motion. Allen looking at Diggs, going to Diggs. Diggs got it. Buffalo touchdown, Stephon Diggs. So good. Makes it look like it's just a little bah, slant. Nope, foot in the ground. You see a lot of time, a lot of teams attempt to do that. Some better than others, but none better than Diggs. Second down and seven. Pass is caught, reaching across for the touchdown. Stephon Diggs. Up in his face, press man, and Stephon Diggs. As soon as he makes that move, you see as he turns around real quickly, whips his head back around because if Gilmore is on top, him and pressure here, they've shown it last couple of times. Allen delivers, touchdown, Stephon Diggs. <laughs> the Buffalo Bills cash in and extend their lead. This throw, laser shot, left side of your screen, 14 and white, and look at this ball. I mean, to the air, Allen stiff arming his way from one defender, throws in there, grabbed by Diggs, was he in? No, on the chalk, incomplete. Try for three, but they'll certainly look at this again, perhaps. After discussion, it is a touchdown. And good for a 10-yard touchdown in the game-opening drive.